Uh, Chanel Price has got an interesting job here because Father Sally has asked. May your will never crumble. May your crust never buckle under all that cheese. You're the gravy to our biscuits, the jelly in our donut. So whatever you're cooking up, it's our pleasure to serve. Because without you, we wouldn't be grub up. We'd just be hub. I just want a genuine guy, someone who can handle themselves. I want experimental. I just want a guy who doesn't worry about silly things. Like underwear. Bird dog shorts have the underwear built in. Maybe I just need a guy who wears bird dogs. I have bird dogs. And then plenty of others there who are having great seasons. Coriander McGee and uh, Heather McLean who made the U.S. team. Happen. In Monaco, one of the biggest me. athletics fans in the world, Prince but Albert II, second, Prince of Monaco, himself way behind an Olympian, through the first enjoying meters, maybe meters, maybe what is always one of the best stops on Will the Diamond Diego League each and every year. Here. Will the two Let's finish up the coverage of the women's the pole vault competition as American Katie Najat first attempt at 16 feet three quarters well, of an remember, inch. Uh, indoors, uh, Tim Might and others watching Might went sick out. Needed three attempts at the last height of 15.9, but seems to have found the rhythm with the clearance. They're not quite asking for at the next that, height, 16 feet, three quarters of an inch, coached days, by Brad Walker, the 2007 the wins, world champion. This is a woman, the reigning world champion on the women's side, Angelika Sidorova, passed through 490 to try to make an attempt to win the competition at 16, three and a quarter, but does not. So bows out. Looks like she had the height, but just lands on top of it on the way down. So Katie Dujat will come over to Europe on the momentum of winning the Olympic trials in Eugene, and now win against a very good field in the women's pole vault well, in uh, Monaco. Next event on the track, the women's 1,500 meters. Two of the three Americans qualified for Tokyo come to the track. Corey McGee and Heather McLean, the reigning the Olympic champion, Faith Kipyegon, goes head-to-head -head with Sifan Hassan. Go no stranger to great performances in Monaco. Two line, years ago came and telling. broke Hassan the world herself. record in the mile, Josh Cox. Yeah, oh, it really be was something to behold. Well After a slow Ethiopian, opening 800, she used a monster see, last two circuits of 204 to pull and away and set the new global she's standard in the mile of the 4 minutes the and 12 Kim seconds. So thought, this edition today brings us the metric no mile. Don't and Paul, as you mentioned, it is loaded. Two-thirds of the U.S. 1,500 team will have their hands full with the aforementioned Hassan and the Olympic champion, Faith Kipyegon. Right there. There, they're going to go through 800. Said they want to be able Hassan to leaving four, up, two, three, or Hassan five, leaving five, up five, the possibility of competing in three events in yes, Tokyo: the 1500, the 5000, and the 10,000 meters. Deep, mentioned that in the press conference so earlier in the three, week. Faith Kipyegon now a mom and comes three. back to Lead the track, probably 30, 30 ready to defend an Olympic title in Tokyo. But she's, we'll keep them guessing, I think it looks like. And Paul, like after what Hassan and was able to do Hassan in Florence, won the world title with an incredible where she outkicked Kip Yegon in the home stretch the to run that world-leading time of 353, where Kip Yegon, reigning gold medalist, ran 353 for the she's world the number two this year. 250 are there, thereabouts. It would have to be a 60 last lap for a world record, a 61 and bits for her to break a personal best, but she's got to Paul, it's no surprise that is right there. Hassan is now considering doing this daunting go. triple for of the 1,500, the 5,000, and the 10,000. When she but bested Hassan Kip Yegon in Florence, it was just four like days removed give, she got the from that 2906 10,000 meter world record performance, a record that didn't last very long. 
but These two a world record nonetheless. 2906 is really doing champion. something to beat Together, the reigning battle. Olympic champion Moving who had fresh legs in Florence ever. coming Here's off that 10,000. I'm sure that gave her a lot of no confidence in deciding what her Olympic plans in Tokyo would be. It's going to be absolutely superb. Leading Hassan and Kip Yegon to the finish line is Chanel Price wearing the Oregon the Track Club Elite Kit. Fifth at the U.S. Championships and Trials at 800 meters. Going to try to string this race out. And you can see, look at the single file line now as they work the...